In this video, we're going to do the first of many challenges. I tried to make these challenges align with what we've already learned, but in some cases, the solution requires a new function or trick that we haven't discussed. Now that's on purpose because in the real world, the problems you come across aren't limited to the things you've already seen. So part of being a good data scientist is having that ability to search for a solution online and to read and interpret documentation. So I'm gonna encourage you to do all of those things in your attempt to solve these problems. All right, let's get started on the first challenge. You and your spouse have decided to let the internet name your next child. You've asked the great people of the web to submit their favorite names, and you've compiled their submissions into a series called Baby Names. Determine how many people voted for the following names, Chad, Ruger, and Zeltron. As they say, there's many ways to skin a cat, but here's the solution that I came up with. The key to my solution is to use the value counts method, which returns the frequency of each unique element in sorted order from most frequent to least frequent. So you can see baby names value counts is a series whose index has the unique values of baby names and whose values are the corresponding frequencies. Since we want to get the frequency of Chad, Ruger, and Zeltron, we can chain baby names value counts with dot log, passing in a list of index values we want to select. In this case, Chad, Ruger, and Zeltron. 